back. And I am back with another Indian snack from my friend Nisha that was sent straight from India. This is, again with her handy dandy notes, this is Jira Bakri. It's, she says the taste is spe spiced and flavorful. It's Jira cumin, and she said best dink dunked in chai. I don't have chai, but I do have tea, so I'm hoping that'll suffice here. All right, I untaped it, but this was the cover. And look, it comes in this whole like uh, get up here. So give me a second, I'll unwrap this and we'll get at it. All right, I'm all thumbs. So one already was perished in me opening that box. So I'm all thumbs, I can't help it. But look at this. It looks like a big cracker of some sort. Now, it looks too big to, to dunk into my tea. So I'm gonna do half of it here. Dunk it into the tea. Again, not chai. But it's the best tea I got in the house here. Mmm. 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 This is delicious. Mmm. Little dunk again. Oh, yeah. Classic India time release happening here. First bite was what? 10 seconds ago? and I'm still getting notes from that. It's still saying, hey, Snack Master General, I'm not going anywhere. I'm gonna stick around in your mouth and your taste and you're gonna love me a little bit longer. That's exactly what I'm doing here. Mmm. I could now, I just wanna, without the tea, do one whole as well, just to get an authentic taste without the tea. It's fantastic. The best way I can describe this, it's like a, an Indian cracker, but tastier, heartier, way better time release, and way different flavor profile than any American cracker I've ever had. I really like this. This is an 8.7.